Hi Sagittarius, it's Leslie with your forecast for May. And, and it's a nice forecast for you too. It's a nice, May is a nice month this month for almost everyone. Um, and I do want to t tell you, everybody's, so many people have been calling me about, do I still do personal readings? And yes, I do. And um, if, you, if you haven't read with us before, we have a special $49 for new clients for 15 minutes. And if you did read with us uh, last month, we'll have a special, the same special for 15 minutes for this, this month for you also. So give us a call if you like. Um, and here, here's your, here we go with your reading, with your um, forecast. Re relationships are soon to be on an even plane and running even smoother, as well as the ability to, to communicate, very much so. And I think, I think sometimes you've just been too busy, too many other things going on in your life, so you two will be able to communicate more, much more and be closer together, have more time to communicate. The best choice for you is to let your emotions roam freely and watch them carefully. Because you're a very giving, loving person, so you want to be careful with your emotions, what you do with them. This can help you move in your life. This can help you if you really watch. Watch. You will sort out priorities and goals and follow them. Your partner trusts you and knows there is no need to worry about you because you can handle everything yourself. You're very, very self-sufficient person in that way. In May, you are under the influence of Jupiter and have, may have exaggerated the ex expectations of life, but um, Jupiter will help you get what you want and will take you places more more places than you've even ever been or thought about being. You will probably expect maximum attention and care from your partner this month. This is a wonderful month to travel, and if you have family that wants to travel with you, that would be fine. Um, you will enjoy the tra wherever you go, whatever you do, you'll enjoy it very, very much. Um, seems like uh, seems like you do a lot of things with your family, and they appreciate it, and they enjoy your attention. They enjoy your attention very much. Um, your best days are the sixth, the fourteenth, and the twenty seventh. We'll see what we'll see what the cards have in store for you. Go. Here you are thinking about something, wondering if you should or you shouldn't make a change here. Um, you're working on something as you do very well. Hmm. Okay, here you are really, really thinking about whether you should make this change one way or the other. Um, actually, it doesn't matter. You may have made your decision. I think you already made your decision. By the time you read this, you'll have made your decision. And here's the star, the star for you. And the star is, you, you have, it's just like your your, um, your forecast. You, you can handle almost anything yourself. Here you have, know who you are. Um, the woman has no clothes on because she doesn't have to hide anymore. Very, very symbolic. She is who she is. And and that's very good for her. And she brings very happy things to her. Very, very, um, very things that are very special and then she brings them about to happen. She's also looking for another goal. She's already got some, some goal has just finished. Hierophant is helping, helping her really, um, helping you really um, decide which way to go about something, especially it has something very spiritual, religious in it. Um, and you're turning more to that in your, your faith. You're just thinking about your faith more and maybe pulling out a little more, not for any special reason, just because you feel more more that way, more inclined that way. Here you are, Page of Cups, um, your most positive influence. So someone is really, really cares about you. Um, it's, well, again, this could be a child, um, especially wants to do something nice for you. Mother's Day is coming up this month of May. Could be that. Um, it could be someone, someone in your life um, a partner that wants to do something very, very special for you and maybe take you someplace you really want to go. Um, could be. You're learning to do something and doing it very well. And you've been doing this for a long time. 
You do, you do it piece by piece, little by little. And your opposition is the lovers, and I, I always feel this card isn't just the physical lovers. It is, it is because you're looking at down underneath the physical part of, of, um, of love. You're looking at the real depth, and the real love there, and the real, real relationship. It's your opposition, but it, will, it, it is here because it's going to move into your outcome. Things will become exactly how you want them. And the hanged man, the hanged man really says, nothing is going on, nothing's really happening. So I'd say your life is just, this month's going to be just kind of status quo, as it always has been, very steady, very, very steady. I mean, things may be happening, but they're, they're steady. No big upsets. And here's his picture, angel card. And it is, love is meant to be easy. Love is meant to be easy, and it is easy for you. Thank you. You have a wonderful month. Bye-bye.